one I can hit or one I can't hit. What's a Gmail? Is it Vicky? You know, you don't email yourself. Yeah. It's not Vicky free? No, no, that's my hotmail oh, one. Okay. Yeah, my legs are wa are all over the place. Okay, I was all over the place. I remember working with you on this um, on this wrist cock yes. business before. Okay, so here you are. And you, you really, I mean, don't you set up? I like, you know, I like a lot behind you. Um, and, you know, lots of good things. I mean, good good shoulder turn, good weight shift. But there's this one little thing right at the top of your swing that I think really gets you in trouble. Okay. You need to really work on the, the wrist cock, the hinging of your hands. Okay. It's like you do this little extra something, and I think it just really gets you in trouble. But look at that good finish. And there's a lot of things to like about this swing. You know, good extension. That chair is really good. Uh -huh. But then right here, instead of just letting the hands relax and calm, you make this little, that, this, this little, little hurt, uh, yeah, And thing. I think it used and to be really more pronounced than it is yeah, now. Yeah, I do. I remember working with you on yes. that before. But, um, but what Funny. I think we need to do is, okay. I think I need to give you a drill with, um, Okay. The L pitch out. I think that will help you more than anything. Okay. So instead of hitting the full shot, we're going to take your sandwich and we're going to learn a different shot that will help you on the course. So, like your, what's on yours? Your, I don't know, unless you got a sandwich. Yeah, I like both of those. One? Yep, that's okay. shorter. Alright, what we're going to do is we're going to do, um, and what's going to happen is it's going to teach you to lag the club. Okay. Because you get up there. Right, and then like, I, I've always had trouble with my back swing. Like yeah, I you almost kind of unload it. So I think if we break it down to a half swing where you're making an L with your arms, you're getting down on the ball and then making an L. Oh, an you L. Know, in okay. Words, yep. it, it's very uh, upright. You know, in other words, it goes up and down, and it gets that ball really high. But notice how my hands are extended. And, my, and I'm not quite on the full finish. I'm not all the way full finish. Okay. I'm in half. Half so, to half. Yeah, so what we want to do is, I want to, I want you to do that because I think it'll teach you.
delay in the Gulfstream is delay the release when you load it, when you store it, and then you unload it right at impact. And then you finish this way too, and you want the, this kind of square and then the arm to extend it. So again, another L. Okay, so, okay. so let's try without a ball a couple times. Get your feet and get your little number one, get that club head up quickly. And then, yeah, and kind of, yes, and you want, so the feeling is that that butt of the club is going down to the ball. Okay. The, the butt of the, the butt this, of the this club right is here. going down. You know what I'm saying? Like right mm -hmm. when you get to your waist high. And then, you, you, yes. Yeah, you see that? It's yeah. Yes. Yeah, and that's why you don't have any difference. Because not, what you're doing right now is doing this. Yeah, you know you're what? Okay. That, this one. You want to just turn, just like it's a miniature box. And this will be good for your sand shots too, because sure. it's really the same shot you use in the sand. But it's also a really great little shot to hit yeah, you know, about good. 40 or 50 yards when the ball goes really high and stops it. So it's yeah, very different. But this, you've got to get you to learn how to lag the club. Yes. Not, you're not lagging it, you're just, it's, you're just going right from the top of the video. She's going into it right here, you know. Right. She kind of loses all the power. So. Exactly. Mm -hmm. I can but tell. Get that a little bit more. It's not. It's kind of common for women and people that didn't play a lot of racket sports. You know, if you didn't play tennis or no. baseball, no. or if you just were a runner or you played soccer, then you don't know how to load the clubs. So that's why it's a really good thing. Yeah, make sure you don't get. Make sure you don't get this kind of movement. You don't want this. Oh, move. okay. Like Bob just does. You want to brace <laughs> it. You know, it's really tight. Yeah. It's a really okay. Tight swing. Tight. Tight. Tight, Here, tight. And there's not a lot of, you know, there's not even a lot of weight shift, and you want to finish kind of like that. Okay. For sure, don't be Bob. <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. it. That's it. Just kind of a half finish too. You know. And you know, you want to be kind of over on that left foot, but you don't, you don't want to make, you want to move it back to the right. You want to just okay. Yeah, I'm not wanna, okay. Yeah, you want to just pivot. Yeah. So there you go. Good. And through. Yeah, but not. Yeah. So this not is what slow. you're doing. You're going. You're going here and then going. <laughs> I want you to go here and then through. You know, I want you to get over partly on the on the left foot. And then boom. Yes, like that. That's all. Doesn't have to okay. be a lot, but you want to finish. That's it. Good. Okay. 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 Don't worry about the ball. Like I would say, just let the ball get in the way, right? That's right. Let the club do the work. Uh -huh. That's what I you know, say. The swing. The swing do the work. The swing do the work. Good. I didn't come through. Let the I didn't come through. Let the club tell you over there. It's not a lot of movement on the back swing, but you definitely want to let the motion of the car be toward the target. Better. There you go. Look at that shot. Isn't that great? Oh my gosh. Isn't that cool? And I hardly <laughs> take yeah, it with the club. Yeah, it's a great 